saffron robes, a vermilion mark, delicately painted on the forehead, a string of beads, around the neck, and a finger pointed to the sky. This is not the image, that comes to mind, when we think of a mathematician, and astronomer. Today's story, is about Arya Bhatt, a well-known mathematician, who was a pioneer, in bringing a change in the field of, mathematics and astronomy. To know more stories, about inspirational and revolutionary people, who have changed the course of mankind, do subscribe to you Wreck a Moment. And don't forget to press the bell icon, for latest updates. Aryabhat was born during, the Gupta, age around 476 AD. Which is also considered, to be the golden age, of mathematics, and ancient Indian learning. The capital of this kingdom, of Margad Patliputra, known as Bihar now, was a great center of learning, the famous University of Nalanda, was situated here. And it is widely speculated, that Aryabhat might have been head, of the astronomical observatory. He was only about 23 to 24 years old, when he composed his most distinguished work, known the Aryabhatiya. It is also said that, he authored, a number of other works, that have been lost the value. Although it is widely known, that Aryabhat developed the zero. In his books, he never actually uses the digit. Contrary to popular belief, Aryabhat did not invent the zero, but came up with the concept of zero. The aspect of mathematics, that he worked upon, is arithmetic, algebra, quadratic equations, trigonometry, and sign table. He also gave the formula, A plus B the whole square. He was essentially responsible, for the birth of modern trigonometry. In fact, names sine, and cosine, are transcriptions introduced by Aryabhat. Besides making contribution to mathematics, Aryabhat also made several discoveries, in the field of astronomy. In those days, it was a common belief, among people that the Earth was the center, of the universe. This concept is known as geocentrism. In his book Aryabhat introduced the concept of heliocentrism. Aryabhat promoted the notion, the Earth spun on its own axis, and the Sun revolved around the Earth, and not the other way around. This belief was deemed a heresy, in most parts of the world, until well past the Middle Ages. He was the first person, to say that Earth is spherical, and it revolves around the Sun. He stated that the Moon, and planets shine by reflected sunlight. Instead of the prevailing cosmogony, where eclipses were believed to be caused by pseudo-planetary nodes, Rahu and K2, he explains eclipses, in terms of shadows cast by Earth, or those shadows that fall on Earth. It is indeed incredible, how Aryabhat could explain, both lunar, and solar eclipse so accurately. He also calculated, the circumference and diameter of the Earth, and the radius of the orbits of nine planets. It is astonishing to think, that one man was responsible, for so many of the mathematical instruments we use, or the geographical facts that are common knowledge today. India's first satellite, was named Aryabhat, as a tribute to the man whose knowledge, knew no bounds just like the limitless space. Aryabhat. A man, beyond his years. Do you know that, Lamborghini was a tractor manufacturing company? Nike, never had its own shoe? And Lego, developed wooden toys before? So, what made them to change? To know more such stories, do look at the stories, in the playlist, over the video, and for the latest videos, do subscribe, and press the bell icon.